Hey, what's going on, fellas? Got my competition die all set it set up for my uh, Lapua brass. This is a uh, neck uh, only, your size. Um, pain in the ass to get it set up, but other than that, it works out pretty good. Um, I adjust it where you can see the media. Well, let me just do a demonstration. Here's uh, my Lupo brass. I dip it in the media. There we go. Place it on here. And there we go. Primer's out. There we go. You see the media? The line right there, you got. What this does is you can turn it counterclockwise and only uh, resize half the half the neck or three quarters or whatever, 50, 60, 70, 80 percent, whatever you want to do. That's that's the beauty about this thing. So really nice. Um, I got one and I want to check the neck tension. I mean, this is not the setup for this. This is for bullets only when it's a loaded round. But decided to put one on there and see how much of a variance is it the neck. So you're looking about a thousandths, just a little over a thousandths, one and a half. I mean, that's pretty good for, you know, these dies. Um, these are second, I mean, they've already been uh, fire form once, so I want to see how they, they, they do. Um, this is the, the Reading Competition Series, S bushing uh, dies. So well worth the money, guys. Um, I do have uh, other dies, Lee's. Uh, those work great too. Um, I'm only using the the writings with the Lupua brass, you know, because the, the Lupua, Lupua brass is gonna be my competition uh, brass. So other than that, it's pretty much it. So if you guys have any questions, uh, let me know. Um, like I said, it's a pain in the ass to get it all set up because you got to take it apart, put it back together, take it apart about ten times. So other than that, uh, catch you guys next time.